Podform makes tracking sound so easy and fast that the writing process and recording process kind of all blend together and happen at once. I use it all the time to create soundtracks and enhance audio mixes when I'm working on video content for Line 6, so I thought I'd walk you through how I have it set up and what the workflow is usually like for me. I'm going to be running the new Podfarm 2.5 and there's a couple things that have just been added that really enhance what Podfarm 2 already does. First off, Podfarm 2.5 is now 64-bit to take advantage of all the processing power in newer computers. So we'll start by opening up Propellerhead Record and working on some music. As you can see, I've already got a drum track added to this project, so the first thing I'm going to do is add a guitar part. I have my guitar hooked directly into a Pod Studio UX1, which is plugged into the back of my iMac via USB. I'm using Podfarm 2.5 in standalone mode, and since I'm using Line 6 hardware, I can use Tone Direct to record directly from the outputs of Podfarm. With this kind of setup, Podfarm functions just like having a mic'd up amp in the other room as opposed to running it as a plug-in on top of a dry guitar signal. Another upgrade in Podfarm 2.5 is that you can run it in standalone mode with any hardware interface now. So if you just want to play around with sounds, you won't have to launch a recording program and then a plug-in version of Podfarm. We've also removed the need for an iLock or Line 6 interface to authorize. Now all that can be done over the internet. So let's set up a guitar sound. Alright, so this first sound, I'm going to go for a clean sound, and I'm going to use this Wishbook Silver 12. I'm going to dial down the drive a little bit to 50%, and I'm going to push the volume up to 100 so that it's still loud enough. That's actually pretty good. So let's make a track and record. And we'll call it Guitar 1. And we should be ready. Another track. We'll name this bass because it's going to be the bass track. And let's go back to Pod Farm. All right, so let's call up a bass tone now. I'm going to use a flip top, and I'm going to turn the volume up on this a little bit. I'm also going to bring the cab in really close so that. It's a really close mic sound. Uh, let's also pull in preamp. Pull in this American Classic, and I'm just going to leave it flat, but it kind of adds a little bit more body to the bass. All right, so let's record this. So the next thing we're going to do is create another track. We'll call this Guitar Chorus. And this is going to be a track that I'm going to add right as we kick into the chorus. This is going to be a distorted track. So let's go back into Pod Farm, And I'm going to use a... Plexi 45. Let's see. Those settings all look pretty good. Let's turn the volume up a little bit. And let's also add a console preamp. And I'm going to bump 3K up. 
just a little bit to kind of give it a little more presence. All right, that all looks pretty good. And let's record it. For this last track, I'm going to do a lead part in the chorus. And so let's go back to Pod Farm. And first off, I'm going to change the mic to a 67 condenser. And I'm going to add a rotary drum and horn. Make the tempo fast, and then I'm going to add a tape echo and I'm going to sync the tape echo up as long as it's the same tempo up there, and I'm going to pull the mix down about 30. Let's check our tuning one more time. That sounds pretty good. I'm going to use the slide for this too. So I think we're ready. So let's record. As you can see, it really didn't take that much time at all, and the best part is that I get to focus on being creative because Podfarm makes it so effortless to pull a sound together. It's even easier now to check it out for yourself because there's a free version available at line6.com slash podfarm. It's limited to just a few models, but you can get an idea of how it works and whether or not it fits into your current production system. For those of you that already have Podfarm 2, it's a free update to 2.5.